Good morning. Sorry if, you know, I'm just getting up not too long ago. Uh, it is about 7, no, 6.20 in the morning. And I'm getting ready to get the girls up for the day. There's so much going on that I have to update you guys on. But it feels good to be talking to you guys. Uh, I have to get the girls ready for daycare. So that's why I'm whispering. And plus it's early too. So let's get the girls up. I'm going to show you that routine. Kind of a routine. And get their hair situated. Get them out the door because they're going with David. And then I'm going to get my day started after that. There's a couple of errands and stuff I want to run. So let's get to it. Get your sister while you get over your temper tantrum. What's wrong? 
Can you tell me what's wrong? Can you tell me why you cry? You can stand up, baby girl. Stand up. Come on, let me help you. Okay. If y'all have any advice on how to combat that, I appreciate it. But come on, Sugarfoot. Gonna start you on the body today. Why wow, she's crying? She's crying because she doesn't want to pull her pants up. Let's put you on the potty today. Yeah, potty. Now, you want to brush your teeth? Brush your teeth? You gotta brush your teeth. So, Nala is eating some muffins. And by the way, I didn't catch it on camera, but David came around and told her to pull up her pants and she did it. The disrespect. Wanna say hello? Say good morning. Say hi. No. Oh, I. She touching computer? No, nah, no, you're not supposed to be touching computer. You know this. And you think you know the mama. It's not at the bottom? Or is she got to touch? There's a marker over here, but it's permanent and write these names, but later in this video, I'll be showing you these stamps I got from this company to be able to mark their stuff for daycare. So hopefully that goes great, but I'm super excited about that. So stay tuned. Time to hit the bell. Don't you shut the door. Rude. You knew I was coming. No, well, she coming. Nala, be careful going by that. Come on, can you open the door? Yours, this one. Push hard, 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 hard. Heart, heart, heart. Oh, you did it. Yay. Frog, frog goes. Ha, you ha. did it. Frog goes, ribbit, ribbit. Elephant goes. Say, That's the elephant. What's this? <laughs> Nala, she's trying to get the elephant. Nala, you're not a driver. Nala. You're not the driver. No. Nala. That's my seat. <laughs> Come on, Alan. I know. Oh, I gotta get my work phone. You okay with that? Yeah. You fuck them. You. Okay. Come on. Get in the seat. One, two, three. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, you did it. Bye, Bye. 
I'm trying to give Nala your stuffed animal. Let's um, up her in a little bit more. She's like cooking in the seat. Okay. A little thing here. Okay. Your head rests a little bit. All right, girls. Let me fix your seat. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a tablet in a second, but I gotta squeeze you in more. Okay. Here's a um, battery. Bye, New Willy. Nala. Nala. Bye, girl. Love you. Say bye to mommy, Nala. Say bye to mommy. It's always the mom they care the least about. <laughs> When it comes to the girl, it's okay. Y'all appreciate me when y'all get older. My baby daddy. Yeah. That's you. Mhm. Mm mm. You got lip gloss on. Mhm. My lips ain't ashy today. Mhm. I like that. Bye. Go on in the house. Bye. <sighs> All right. Can finally like, get my life together. That was a little hectic today. But it is what it is. I am hungry though, so I need some coffee and a breakfast bowl. We started getting these little breakfast bowl things from Sam's Club, and they're so good. Let me show you. It's this. These little breakfast bowls. I don't know what they're called. I think they're by Dirty Okay, so it's breakfast bowls. It's dirty rice with eggs and sausage. If I can think to put it up, I don't feel like going to the deep freezer <laughs> to grab the box. But all you do is punch a hole in it or cut a hole in it. And then cook it for like, it says two minutes and then stir and then another minute, but I just did three minutes. And that's good enough for me because, no, I'm not doing all that back and forth. Not at all. Not at all. Okay? For your ex. No, I'm not Jamaican. Oh, my kick a little dusty, child. I need some coffee, though, so. Let's make some coffee. I wonder if I may, should make an iced coffee. Let's do a frappe instead this morning. Let's do that. Um, if you didn't know, I made some bomb frappes. If you want to know, like, in-depth re recipe, I'm going to try to show you guys. But if not, it's better just to go to my TikTok and I break it down two different times. My very first video and somewhere, somewhat recent, you'll see my hot version. But my ice frappe version is my very first TikTok video. I don't know about y'all, but I be feeling like, um, hot coffee is good for, like, when I want to study, when I want to focus, when I want to wake up. Cold coffee or frozen is good for when I just kind of 
still want that little pick me up but i intend on like doing errands being busy being outside you know that type of stuff which is what i intend to do in a little bit of both and it's a good laxative too this is what the breakfast bowl is looking like so good mm. love these things got onions peppers I don't even really need nothing. Yep. So, I'm going to eat. Get my mind together and then I'm going to come to y'all after I'm done. To kind of tell you guys what's going on. A little update. And then I plan on organizing the girls' clothes because there's a lot of clothes that they, um, have gone out of that I just need to get rid of as well as um, I need to label a lot of their clothes their new clothes and I need to go out and run some errands I do not work today honestly I don't work at all but we'll get into that <laughs> really soon all right obviously several hours later because the girls are home I had ended up doing some other work and that kind of, you know, took up my time. And me and David switched cars and now we're back here. Nala is crying because she want more than her two cookies. And she want to take Noelle's cookie. I already had a pep talk with her. And now, honestly, she's crying now because I'm talking and annoying her. So, you know what this means? This means I deserve a drink. She wanted the lunch of it, but she has to eat food. She doesn't need more than two cups. Nala, you cannot have more than two cookies. So I have to ignore her so that she get distracted with something else. Cause I'm not gonna entertain. Cause the moment I put the camera on her, she start crying. She just let that mean she's fine. I look like a hot sweaty mess. I literally been out all day long. By the way, my Christmas tree is still here. If you knew. I keep my tree up as long as until I'm tired of it. So, anywhoosie, I told you guys I would give you a life update. I wish I was looking better when I gave it to you, but here we go. So, I have officially decided to get rid of my job. So, today is actually my last day, technically, but I put in time vacation for the day and it's officially it i'm not no longer working at my job i am i don't think i talk about it enough but uh if i don't know i am on journey to get my cdl i'm actually probably two or three weeks away from getting it you might be like why would you quit your job two or three weeks early and that's because one health reasons and i plan on talking about that in another video but i am just physically done I had to drive like over an hour like an hour away for work the job is just it was easy but it was enough for me so cut it off I had a conversation with David tell him about other avenues we can do in the meantime even like doing gig gig apps and stuff like that so he agreed and I'm home so I plan on doing gigs and other little avenues to make quick tip money so that I can prepare for my mommy makeover. I do want to have an entire mommy makeover. Uh, y'all probably don't know this because I don't talk to y'all about it, but people who really know me knows that I 
want surgery. I want to have my breasts done. Uh, you might be like, they're not that bad. Y'all don't see them. Y'all don't know that. Um, but I definitely want boobs, lipo, because I have a kangaroo pouch that won't go anywhere. I had one kind of prior to kids, but after kids, it's just really not going nowhere. I already been told previously I would have to have lipo to get it down. So my plan is to have liposuction 360, arm lipo, a boob, and possibly a little bit of hips because I don't have any. I got a booty. I don't need that. I don't need a BBL, but some some hits for my hip dip. And I want to get my teeth done. <sighs> Again, I went the braces route. It didn't work for me. Uh, the well, health of my teeth isn't there, so I am planning on getting porcelain veneers. So I'm hoping within the next year, um possibly less than a year my goal at least while i'm doing these other avenues day jobs run a dog print jobs and stuff like that that i'm able to uh save up enough money to get my body done i have not solidified in who as far as doctors that i would want to see for my teeth i have and i am gonna do the whole columbia thing if you don't agree with going to Columbia, don't tell me because I already know, I already heard it, I already done the research. I'm just letting y'all know what's going on. So you don't gotta tell me stuff that I already know because I already know. I'm gonna do it regardless. It's just when. So my teeth is definitely getting done. And my body is something I'm also definitely doing. If you don't agree with cosmetic surgery, keep it to yourself. Even if it something happens, that's my own. This is my own life, my own body. Just leave it. But it is happening. So right now, that's kind of the goal of what I'm working for. So, um, yeah, that's kind of what's going on. Your girl is officially jobless. Oh, not jobless. But an entrepreneur. It's grind time. David's grinding right now. He's working towards the same goal. Uh, I have also come with it come to my teeth. I'm not gonna do a close up because I'm just not that comfortable. But I have a partial veneer inside of my one of my front teeth, and that's only supposed to last up to ten years, and it's been twelve. And if that thing goes, it's over. I want to start prepping for that as soon as possible because I cannot lose a front tooth. I just can't do it. And I can see no matter what, I went through the two years of braces, the health of my gums is just not healthy. My teeth aren't healthy at all. Um, unhealthy teeth actually runs in my family. My mom has really bad teeth. Sorry, mom. My dad has super bad teeth. Um, I remember growing up that um, my dad actually had no top teeth. And technically, my mom does too. Um, and he, my dad actually got veneers all in his mouth. So, yeah, I wonder what he did. I should ask my dad. Let me go call my dad. Let me see if he'll tell me. I don't know if he got crowns or veneers, but I'm gonna probably send him some photos now because he might want to go. It, you know, it'd be dope if I can get my dad. Dang, why I'm trying to get my dad to refix his teeth when he fixed it? But I don't think he's 100% happy with his teeth. So, but I think he might got crowns, and if he got crowns, they f them over. Where my daddy phone? Oh, my dad's phone never off. I guess it's falling off. Okay, well, so much for that. But I don't think he's 100% through his teeth, so I might text him uh, the photos and what I plan on doing. Because I know he can get the shmoney. Maybe we can go together. Father, daughter, duo. Maybe. And yeah, so I'm supposed to be cleaning up the girls' room and tagging them. Oh! Let me show you guys. That was kind of like a big part of the video. 
let me show you guys what I have received because I am very, very interested in loving the fact that I got this thing. Hold on, let me go grab it. All right, so I decided to kind of move quickly into the other room so that you guys can hear me a little bit better. I'm in the girls' playroom. So I am actually excited because I am collaborating with this company that hit me up on Instagram asking me if I could give a review and demo and try out that product. The product is called the Name Stamp. If you see it here, this is what their packaging kind of looked like. They actually reached out to me at the, ooh, getting dark. I was so happy, literally so happy when they reached out to me because I was looking for a product like this. And if you don't know anything about the name stamp, they are a company that you can have personalized name stamps that you can use, especially coming in handy when it comes to daycare where you have to mark your children's clothes. Um, when they reached out to me, I did get a stamp for each one of my girls. So Nala and Noel have a personalized name stamp. And you can also pick what the stamp looks like and everything like that. And I just got to show you guys what it looks like because it, it is so cute. So when you open up the box, this is what it's gonna look like. And again, anything in regards to this, uh, they are not paying me to talk about it. They just asked if they could send this to me. And I say, yeah, dope, because I was about to buy something like this anyway. But when you open up the box, it just says, hey there, why are you reading this? I'm waiting for you to unbox me. Feel free to take a photo of me, upload it to my story. Thank you for supporting a small business. Um, these things are so cute. And this is what it looks like, the ones I got. And I personally picked these ones because I thought it was just so cute. So again, this is what the stamp looks like. Let me bring it out. Now, I don't know how to use this yet. So we're going to be doing this together. But I really need something like this because I'm constantly buying clothes because they darn near wear the same size and then they're constantly switching cuts between classes because they're in two different classes. So they're constantly telling me how whatever I wrote on their items is coming off and all kind of things. So yeah, so this one right here is Noelle's and it's just like a little blue owl. Ain't that so cute? This is so freaking cute. Oh, I love it. And this one is Nala's. So this is what it's looking like. So freaking cute and I like it like that they're like kind of this big and don't blend in because then I won't lose them but I gotta hope that I put it somewhere where they won't get a hold of them because then they might think it's a toy so I need to read some instructions because I don't know how to do this I did bring some shirt a shirt and shorts and a bottle to try to imprint and see what it looks like because I can say all these things but how does it work does it do what it's supposed to do <sighs> hold on kids calling me yeah baby I'm back child so anywho um I need to figure out how to use this because this is what actually comes in the box too and I'm guessing they're like type of paper roll I'm not really sure Right here, there's a little card that says, thank you. And it says, we hope the packaging brighten your day as much as yours has made ours. To say thank you, we're giving you 20% off on your next order with us. But there's no directions? Do I just stamp? What is this for? Do I need to look at a tutorial? Maybe so. Why are these on here? Do these have a purpose? Oh Lord, listen, the name stamp, y'all couldn't put instructions in here? You know I'm slow. Okay, now I gotta try to look at a TikTok or something. Okay, one, two, wait, don't be upside down. Yay! So I'm guessing you just can't watch this for a while? That is so simple. I mean, even though it looked like I just got to get the hang of it, but look. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's going to make my life so much more easier. Because, let me tell you, even this morning, I almost wish 
that I kind of practiced this morning so it can look a lot better. But I actually got a whole bunch of new sippy cups that I want to, you know, mark up. Because, you know, I have to start getting both of the girls, bringing them to daycare. So, having something like this, this tap and go, trying to find markers all the time. Yeah, I ain't trying to do that no more. Let me see if there's something else I can mark up for no apparent reason. Oh, I have these shorts. Yeah, this is no else. So let's do that. And I have, maybe I can do the tag. Let's try a tag this time. So I am, I really don't wanna do that side. Let's do this side. Let's see what it looks like when I do a tag. Oh, that was perfect! Oh, look at that. It sounds like I'm being so dramatic, but I guarantee. Oh, yep. You can't get it twisted no more. Yep. I think I got the hang of it now, y'all. I'm going to try to mark this cup and see if that works. Oh, look at that. I almost had it perfect, too. It looks so good, though. You can't miss that. You can't miss it. Let me try to do the other side. Who cares if I double do it? That almost was perfect. Okay, obviously it's user error. It's gonna take a little practice. But I love this. I'm scared to touch it. Okay, don't mess it up. So, marking the box because now why not? Let's just stamp everything. I feel like I'm gonna always have a reason to just stamp stuff. See that? That is perfect. So you guys, this definitely does work. I definitely 100% recommend this because why would you want to use a pen when you don't have to at all? There's just a learning curve to it. It just could be me. Yep, see? Y'all know what name that is. You just gotta make sure that you are letting it dry. So don't be like me and be overzealous and move around. Like it definitely probably has to sit like anything that you mark up with anything permanent. It says that you can wash it and it won't come out. So um, I think you probably wouldn't want to do it within 24 hours. So I would lay low off of that. But I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend a hundred percent this will be near um all my little daily tasks because what we started doing was uh marking up their clothes for the whole week and we'll set it out the whole outfit for the entire week so now when david does the washing when we do the setting up we can just automatically start stamping all those clothes which i was planning on doing today in this video but probably gonna end up doing this in another video i would definitely tag them in the description box below as well i believe they have a discount code that i'll put there as well if you are interested Thank you, The Name Step, for reaching out to me and asking me to review these because I do love them, I do appreciate them, and I do need them. And that's the most important thing. So thank you for reaching out and sending these to me. But now I am going to get ready to let the girls go outside for a little bit to let them get some free air. You blowing bubbles, Noah? Bubble. Bubble. Blow bubbles, baby. Mommy. Good job. Hey. No, thank you. You can blow it. <coughs> and before you ask, I would blow it, but if once I start blowing it, they want me to blow it the whole time. When I'm trying to get them to be independent. All done? All done. All done. <coughs> <laughs> You want help? Yeah. Help? <laughs> Can you put it in the chair? Noel. Let's see. I don't need her to do that, but let's see if she goes. 
Noel, can you put it in the chair? You gotta take your shoes off. Good job. Hey. hey. Take your shoes off, Nala. Yeah, I think so. Oh, saw, saw. Yeah. You need help? Look. Look, you have a latch here. You see? And pull it off. You can do it, baby. I know you can. Yeah. And pull it off. Yeah, good okay. job. Take your sock off. Uh, good job. Uh, I kind of just let uh, them, if they've been playing all day, they'll kind of get their clothes dirty, so I don't really care. Most of the time, we do put them in swimsuits, so. But these are their play clothes, anyway. Good job. She got on trampoline by herself for the first time. Let's see. I don't know why, but Noah hates walking in grass, so she's crawling. If you wanted me to carry you, I can carry you. I'm trying to not be so like, oh my God, jump in situation. So that's what she want to do. I'm just let her do it. Let Noel come in. Good job, Noel. I stay in. Is stay in or out? Mommy up. Mommy up. I don't want to get up. What's wrong with you? What's wrong? Why are you crying? What did she do? Ignore me. She ignoring you? She ignoring you? Go give her a hug. You wanna give me a hug? I can give you a hug. You feel better? Yeah. Good. Let's see now. <laughs> there ain't nothing just happened to her. <laughs> Y'all just seen it. I can give you a hug. It's my big baby. Here you go. Uh, uh. Don't bust it now. Yeah. You sleepy? Yeah, I could sleepy. She just in one of her moods right now. Tell me, do y'all kids do stuff like this? Do y'all kids do stuff like this? Because I be wondering. Because sometimes she do the temper tantrums, child. So I'm going to just let them continue to play and tantrum. Look, she okay. I'm going to let them be great, be babies, do them. And pretty soon, probably in the next 10 15 minutes, we're gonna get ready for baths and bed. I think this is gonna be it for me because I need to get these girls down and get mommy me time because, child, it's a lot. Definitely love you guys and see you guys in the next video.